Hi, boys and girls. I'm here today to read you an Easter story. It's called The Quiet, Crazy Easter Day. It may have been a quiet day when Jesus rose again, or it may have been quite crazy as the world rejoiced back then. The rabbits must have pitter-pattered with their bunny feet, while froggies croaked and birdies chirped and locusts kept the beat. I think the wolves began to howl and giant eagles soared while ladybugs swooped loop-de-doo all for our risen Lord. With fishes blowing bubbles and worms inching right along, the groundhogs hopped and the chipmunks bopped and doves cooed the song. The goats and sheep out in the fields began to bleat and baa. The ladies with their spices must have yelled loud, hooray. I think the angel glistened with a bright and radiant light as deer and elk out of the woods all pranced in pure delight. Disciples surely shouted when they found the empty tomb. And if a peacock been there, it may have spread his plume. As butterflies burst through cocoons, they spread their pretty wings. They couldn't help but celebrate the risen King of Kings. With pitter-patter chirps and howls and bubbles blown in praise, all creatures celebrated in their own distinctive ways. And Jesus rose up from the tomb to take our sins away, and though we cannot see him, he is still alive today. He hears us when we talk to him. He hears each girl and boy. He loves us with great big love and brings hope, peace, and joy. Let's thank and praise the risen Lord, then we can really strive to spread the truth of Easter Day. Christ Jesus is alive. Bah! And happy Easter. Praise be to the God, the Father of the Lord Jesus Christ. In his great mercy, he has given us new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ. 1 Peter 1.3